Okay, Ben Ponce, head uh, high school boys basketball coach, Riga High School. You guys are getting ready to open up against Humboldt, kind of been one of your rivals in the last couple of years. Is this a game, you know, you usually start with this game. Is this a game that you get excited for? Absolutely. The uh, season opener is always an exciting time for us. Um, you know, we want to see what, everybody gets tired of scrimmage against each other, so we kind of want to see what it's like for um, to get out there and play somebody different. Um, you know, we've lost five, six really good kids the last couple of years, you know, and uh, they've also kind of gone through the same thing. So it'll be kind of interesting to see how both of us uh, can play at this at this level with uh, with different personnel in there. All right, and this is the last gym you played in last year, and you guys beat them in the semifinal, a pretty good game. Um, I know it's a different team, but is there some – you know, wanting to get back there and play a little bit? Yeah, we really enjoy, you know, they've hosted uh, Substate a couple times since I've been there, and we've been there and been able to win a couple games, fortunately. But, you know, our seasons have ended there a couple years, too. So going back and kind of erasing that last game of the season, uh, get that out of our, that taste out of our mouth is always an exciting thing. So, you know, we're excited to go down there and play and uh, just compete. And then I think it's, what, th three, of the la three of the last three years you made it to the Substate Finals and lost – what is it going to take for you to think this season to get over that hump? Uh, you know, I, teams in the past, you know, we just had a little glitches here and there. Um, we still, we have a couple guys on our team that have been here for three years that is, they're going into their fourth that are expected to be leaders on our team, and they're you know they have they're very anxious to get that taste out of their mouth of being knocked out at the end of the season. So um, as far as getting to the state tournament, you know we've. We've got those sub-state yesterday, and we're going to be going out west, so it's going to be a completely different field of what we've seen in the last three years. So uh, we're just going to hopefully be playing our best basketball in March. Okay, and then um, you've got a couple guys returning double-digit scores. How will their roles uh, step up this season? Well, you know, Braden was our leading scorer last year, and so we, look, we expect him to be at least either the top one or two uh, scores for this year for us. Um, and he, he knows what it takes, and he's put in a lot of work over the summer to, to, to make himself a better player. So I expect him to average pretty close to or more than what he had last year at 17. Uh, Dial and I expect, you know, we've had a lot of weapons over the last couple of years, and he's kind of taken back to, so I expect him to also increase his uh, numbers from this year for this year as well. Okay, and then if you say you guys have a goal for the early season and then a goal for the entire season, what would those be? Uh, early season is to go over and win the Marion Tournament um, next week. And our, our always a, a goal of ours is to win the conference. All right. Thank you. Yep.